driving in here. <laughs> You're not driving in there, Mike, are you? Okay, we have pontoons on the side of the jeeps. But we don't really care. <laughs> that was a big bump there, right? Yeah, that's a good one. Remember, hey, this is hey. Okay? <laughs> to the right out here, there's a little depression in the air. In the ground, uh, dry creek area. Favorite hangout for mule deer? You see any deer out? Nope. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Back there. <laughs> I'm getting some air back here. Good, good. <laughs> what are you talking about? Lifting you up off the seat, huh? I might do pink Jeep for my job. <laughs> <laughs> place to get a good view of what what, uh, what we can see out in the distance out there. The highest peaks out there to the left, that's what they call the Mocion Rim, or the edge of the Colorado Plateau. Now this Colorado Plateau out here covers about 150,000 square miles of our four corner states. And everybody knows what our four corner states are, right? Yeah. No. Yeah. Come on. It's Arizona, New Mexico, Mexico that's it, that's Colorado, it. Utah. You want to come up here and drive? Let me sit back there and enjoy Okay. <laughs> All right. I am not want I didn't even know that when I was trained up here for this job. Good man. All right. Yeah, absolutely correct, Alex. So we got 150,000 square miles. It's a heart-shaped plateau. It. If you're standing on the Grand Canyon looking down into that giant hole in the earth, you are standing on the Grand, on the Colorado Plateau mm -hmm. in New Mexico, all the way in the north uh, western edge of North New Mexico is part of the Colorado Plateau, all the way up into Utah, uh, probably about uh, 150 miles. Uh, you're going to get run into. You're still on the Colorado Plateau. This is the southwestern edge right there, as far as your eyes can see, and geologists tell us that it's eroding on the way up to the Grand Canyon, creating all this beautiful. Uh, like the Verde Valley out here, the Red Rock Buttes, it's eroding away. 